from the hospital to the Hawthorne Inn, uh, basically to give our patients a more comfortable experience for their sleep study. Uh, we opened here at the Hawthorne Inn uh, October the 4th in 2009, um, hoping that it would give a better experience for our patients, uh, free parking, uh, handicap entrance, uh, easier for them not to get lost on the way to the sleep lab, uh, more comfortable beds, uh, they can check in early and check out late. They can get a continental, hot continental breakfast in the morning with their sleep study. Um, and the beds are very comfortable. I think a lot of the patients have expressed that. Uh, and overall, it's been a lot better experience for the patients, uh, especially asking the ones that have had their sleep studies done at the medical center and then having their study done here, what the differences were and uh, most of the patients have said that it is a better experience for them. Um, we treat all forms of sleep disorders, obstructive sleep apnea, uh, insomnia, uh, narcolepsy. Um, there are a lot of sleep disorders, sleep terrors, nightmares, uh, night terrors. Uh, I basically have 10 technologists working in the sleep lab. We currently run eight beds here at the Hawthorne Inn. Um, we do have a, a nurse practitioner that will see the patients every morning to go over the results with them before they leave, um, which is something that I think is good. The patient gets an immediate response on their study to let them know what um, the results were. Um, also, they have follow-ups with her, and eventually we plan on setting our CPAPs up uh, the same morning for the patients that require CPAP, uh, they will be set up and be able to go home with those machines, and that's something that uh, is, is kind of unique to the uh, industry.